Hey, it's Alan from Hack Gadgets here. Do you have a Tesla and hate plugging it in? Let's go check out a cool solution for that problem. Hi, my name's Dave Barman. I'm with Fulton Innovation. I'm here to show you e-coupled technology. What we have here is we've got a Tesla that's charging wirelessly. Our wireless power technology, what it does is it allows us to tune um, basically inductive coupling technologies to where we can have a primary and a secondary that allow us to be able to adjust for a complete system performance. Meaning that when you park in a different location each time, our system automatically adjusts to that configuration. This is what makes this inductive coupling much more efficient, uh, cost effective, and actually allows us to make this technology in such a way that allows it to be much more interoperable. By having the adjustability, the system can actually perform in such a way that it, that, that it enables us to be able to um, control the power levels, to be able to adapt for um, changes in the environment, changes in spacing, um, and that, that dynamic adjustment is really what um, e-coupled is about. So whether we do this, whether we do this for low power charging, or whether we do this for high power charging, or even packaging, that's what our technology is doing: is being able to adjust frequency, being able to adjust our tank circuits, and being able to um, adjust to the complete environment to charge wirelessly. So what we have here is inductive power that powers packaging. We're making packaging more functional, meaning that we can actually print circuits with just conductive inks inside these packages that allow them to become much more functional. If you notice a difference, we've got lighting built into this package and we do that simply by having, having a surface that allows, or a, a spring that allows us to push those products to the front. We've all seen those auto-facing products. What we do is we have one wireless power circuit in the front that actually powers the, the box. We can detect um, levels of product, expiration dates, um, we can light the product, and we can get identity from the product. In this case, what we can actually do is we can actually power product in packaging. So now your packaging can demo itself. Your product can demo, and it can actually even interact with your product. In this case, what we're doing is we can actually have a temperature sensor built into the, the product by simply printing it in addition to a coil and by setting it on a high power base we can actually cook right in right in this product more efficient than a microwave faster than a microwave and more controlled than a microwave so that's pretty much it for what we're doing in in wireless power combined with packaging really solving the problem of how do you get power to packaging um, that that people have been looking for for years